Well, the numbers are staggering. Hate crimes against the Asian community rose by 107% in California last year. That's from a new report out today by the state attorney general's office. The AG blames the spike on anti-Asian rhetoric from some political leaders. NBC Barry's Lili Tan has more from San Francisco, where a series of Asian-owned businesses were vandalized overnight. Shock. Uh, we saw broken uh, glasses on the floor. Sai Ung's family owns the Hip Tan Market, one of three businesses in San Francisco's Little Saigon, vandalized early Wednesday morning. We've been in business for like about 20 years. We haven't seen anything like this before. And it's like the first time you know to experience this, and it's shocking and you know scared like you know they might do this again in the future the other businesses with smashed windows were quickly a bubble tea shop and a ginseng shop which also focus on serving the asian community this state sees you to the asian american community across the bay in oakland's chinatown we're going to keep you safe california attorney general rob bonta released a special report on anti-asian hate crimes it found the number of anti-asian hate crimes in california from 2019 to 2020 more than doubled an explosion that really took off in march and april during the first two months of the covid 19 pandemic bonta says the real number is likely much higher there was a surge in anti-Asian violence correlated with the words of leaders who sought to divide us when we were at our most vulnerable. A vulnerability the Asian American community is still feeling even as the pandemic recedes. In a statement, San Francisco police told us that the businesses that were vandalized, quote, appear to serve the Asian community, but at this time could not say whether they were targeted for that reason. In San Francisco, Lily Tan, NBC Bay Area News. Overall, hate crime in California has reached its highest reported level in more than a decade. These are the numbers released by the state attorney general today. Hate crime surged by 31 percent last year, rising from just more than 1,000 attacks to more than 1,300. The report says the increase was fueled mainly by a big jump in attacks on the black community. Black people account for less than 7 percent of the state's population but were victims in 30% of hate crimes. The report also found that while hate crimes based on race increased, those prompted by religion dropped more than 13%. Incidents with a gender bias also increased, nearly doubling from 2019.